Let's get going upgrading our subgraphs to the graph network. But first, what is upgrading? Upgrading transfers a subgraph from the hosted service to Subgraph Studio, and then publishes it to the graph network for increased reliability. What is Subgraph Studio? Subgraph Studio is a development environment for subgraphs. Deployed subgraphs in Subgraph Studio are indexed for development and testing purposes. Deployed subgraphs are rate limited, free to query, but not meant to be used in production. Deployed subgraphs in Subgraph Studio have the option to be published to the graph network. Published subgraphs are indexed by the indexers in the graph network, where there is no rate limiting as well as improved speed, reliability, and redundancy. So what are the benefits of upgrading a subgraph to the graph network? Upgrading is free with no gas fees. Upgraded subgraphs are immediately available on the graph network. There's a higher reliability and redundancy due to the hundreds of independent indexers on the graph network, and hosted service endpoints will eventually expire. So now, let's upgrade a subgraph to the graph network. We'll start at thegraph.com. Go up to Products, Hosted Service, then we'll go to My Dashboard on Hosted Service. On My Dashboard in the Hosted Service, we can see a button that says Upgrade Subgraphs. Click on that. From here, we can see we have two subgraphs that need to be upgraded. This process typically takes around five minutes. Just know that when we upgrade our subgraphs, they cannot go back to the Hosted Service. Feel free to read through the rest of these bullet points, and let's continue on. Here we can see the two subgraphs that need to be upgraded. The first subgraph has 18,000 queries on it. Any upgraded subgraph that has over 10,000 queries on it in the last 30 days will automatically be published to the graph network. Once published, the upgraded subgraph is immediately available for production traffic through the upgrade indexer. For fully network-enabled chains, adding curation would attract more indexers for even better reliability. This next subgraph has zero queries on it in the last 30 days. This subgraph will not be published to the graph network when upgrading. This subgraph will be available in Subgraph Studio and could be manually published to the graph network. So now that we've gone over what upgrading a subgraph to the graph network is, let's go ahead and upgrade both of our subgraphs. We'll need to select the receiving wallet, and if we would like, we could change the receiving wallet. We won't do that here. And here we are upgrading our subgraphs. The upgrade is completed. Let's check out our upgraded subgraphs in Subgraph Studio. The subgraph that had more than 10,000 queries on it in the last 30 days was automatically published to the graph network, as we can see here. This subgraph is indexed on the graph network and available for production queries immediately. If the index chain is fully supported by the graph network, more curation would attract more indexers to index this subgraph. Our next subgraph that had zero queries in the last 30 days is simply deployed to Subgraph Studio and not the graph network. It is available for development and testing purposes. Check the links in the description below to learn more about upgrading a subgraph to the graph network.